Hey, what's up, you guys? It's Jackson, and welcome back to another video thing. So, if you're new to my channel, hello, I'm Jack. How you doing? Make sure you hit that subscribe button down below, and also give the video a thumbs up by the end of it if you enjoy it, because that really helps your boy out. <laughs> so, um, today's video is once again not clickbait. Um, this is legit. Admit this actually happened. So, when I was about 14, I think I started um, liking Fifth Harmony, which is the band that currently is now split up. Uh, they only recently properly split up, but I was a huge, huge fan of uh, Fifth Harmony and I understood and kind of learned what ships were that year. If you don't know what a ship is, I'll put the Urban Dictionary definition right here of what a ship is. Um, I don't really know how to explain it, so I'll just let Urban, Urban Dictionary do its thing. That's what's there for. So in Fifth Army, there was two band members that I shipped, Camila, Lauren. So if you don't know who they are, this is Camila Cabello, this is Lauren Haregi. They're great people, I love them both. So I think the first fan fiction I read about Cameron was one called Trials and Tribulations that actually took me so long to read. Like that shit was like a novel. I would spend like hours upon hours reading Cameron fan fiction. For some reason, I was just like obsessed with this ship and I would. <laughs> I'm sorry, I just, I became obsessed with it and I was just like, yeah, I was a fanboy. So after um, a bit of deliberation, um, I think that's the word for it anyway, I don't know, I'm not good at English, but um, I decided, you know what? Gonna write my own fan fiction. <laughs> so there's this great place called Wattpad. And um, if you're like an LGBT queer emo gothic person, you've probably gone on Wattpad and rad, rad, read a fan fiction about somebody that you like or a ship that you like or just something that you like. So I decided to make an account on Wattpad um, and start writing a book about Cameron. Yeah. So yeah, I was like 15, 14, I don't even know what age I was, but for the whole summer, um, I think I was like working on this book and then by the end of it, I think it was like the last month of summer, I decided to write in like a chapter a night. I think I got like 30 chapters in and it was like a thousand words a chapter. Like I was committed, committed to this thing. So yeah, I decided to do that, which was real great fun. And me being me, I told my friends and I was like, this is really funny. I wrote a fan fiction. Um, there, it wasn't just like a family friendly fan fiction. Like it was a fan fiction definition if you've read a fan fiction you know what i'm talking about there was shit in there that was not cool that i shouldn't have like if i go back and read it now it's really sad like it's so i just thought that would be up there for me to look back on and read and laugh about when i was older um but it's actually quite successful on wattpad um i still have it up because i find it funny um i check on it every now and then like i get like hundreds of notifications on wattpad and i'm just kind of like <laughs> Vicky. I think it has like over 300,000 reads. I'm not sure, I'm gonna check, hold up. So the fan fiction has over 300,000 reads, um, which is like, hmm. I'm trying not to give too much away because I don't want you guys going and looking for it because it's just something that I'm quite embarrassed about, but I don't want to take it down. I don't know, it's weird. Like I don't want people to find it, but I don't want to take it down because people don't know me. They don't know who wrote it. So like if people knew who wrote it, it'd be very, very awkward. So yeah. But yeah, um, I just wanted to share the story about that. Like, I was just obsessed with Cameron and I decided to make a fan fictione about them. And I actually did, like, some of my junior cert project, which is, like, an exam when you're, like, 15 in Ireland. And I did that based on, uh, like, LGBT. And I did a few Cameron drawings. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, it's funny, though, because, like, people still comment on it to this day. And I'm like, how do people keep finding this like Cameron is dead people like they are dead like obviously like, the people aren't dead but like Cameron the ship is like <laughs> so yeah that's my story for today's video I wrote a successful fan fiction um and I don't I just I don't want to give too much away because I don't want you guys to find it but if you do find if you think you've found it um DM me on Instagram here and I'll let you know if that's what I wrote because it'd be funny but yeah go DM me on Instagram, see if you can find it. Um, if you get it right, I will be honest about it. I'll let you know. Just don't like share it on the internet because that's kind of weird. <laughs> but yeah, that's it for this video. Um, if you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. I'm trying to like think of as much content to produce that I possibly can. So if you have any video ideas, like literally anything at all, comment them down below. I might do like a dare and dare with my brother or like 
sister or dog, I don't fucking know. A lot of you want to see videos of my girlfriend Kate, so like, hopefully some of that content coming soon. Um, mainly just kind of like sit down with my new, this background, uh, because I've officially moved into the, my new room, um, which means this is going to be my background from now on, so I hope that's chill with you. Uh, if you want me to do any reacting videos, once again, you can either DM me on Instagram or you can comment them here. I don't know, whichever you prefer, because like, it's your life. It's your life. So yeah, as usual, I hope you had, have, or are having an amazing day. I still can't believe I can say that without stuttering. So yeah, I, I'll see you all in the next video. Ciao.